Hey everybody, this is James. This is not a full episode, just a quick little update and a request for some assistance. Today is March 13th, 2023, and episode 3 of season 8 will be out in two days. That's season 8, Unresolved, The Murder of Joel Loveling. Which brings me to my request. I'm looking for any of you locally who were friends with Joel Loveling. Maybe you worked with him at Altru Hospital, or maybe you went to school with him or knew him as a kid. I'd like to gather a few more memories of him for the podcast. If you can help me learn more about Joel Loveling, who he was, what he was like, please send me an email at dakotaspotlight at gmail.com. That's dakotaspotlight, one word, at gmail.com. I would really, really appreciate it. And while I have you, let me remind you about an event. Well, a couple of events, actually. I plan to be at the Fargo Film Festival to speak at a luncheon panel about true crime. That's the 24th of this month. The Fargo Film Festival. Maybe I'll see you there. But looking further down the road, Wowza and Kalamazoo are going to be playing live in Bismarck on Saturday, May 13th. You've heard their music a lot on this podcast, including the theme songs for Season 5 about Barbara Cotton and Season 7 about Missing Michelle Juleson. I'm going to be there to see Wowza and Kalamazoo play live at the Laughing Sun Brewery in Bismarck on Saturday, May 13th. In fact, I just gave Ike Turner of Wowza and Kalamazoo a call, and I recorded it. Here it is. Hey, my friend Ike, how are you? I am doing great, James. How are you doing? Good. But where are you? Michigan. I am in, yeah, right now, Kalamazoo, Michigan. I'm in my garage, um, a <laughs> band that I am playing drums with on a little tour here, like a five-day tour, is currently inside my house showering, and we're going to eat some soup and go play a show tonight. And yeah, it's been a real, it's been pretty nice. Yeah. Cool. How, how many bands are you in, by the way? Or do you even know yourself? <laughs> <laughs> like 12 that's a great question <laughs> uh, i it's yeah it is pretty well i don't i i think somewhere around 10 that i play or have you know kind of ongoing projects with and then there's a few others that we're kind of working on that uh yeah you know i mean i've like i've probably i've probably said this a million times before to other people but uh, you know, some people have like the hobby of gardening or golf or whatever, but this is this is the hobby I settled on. So, <laughs> yeah. So I just looked at the calendar. It's the 13th of March, which reminds me that it's exactly two months until you are going to be playing Laughing Sun Brewery in Bismarck, which I'm going to be there. Can't wait. That's still on or what are we thinking? Oh yes, we're super stoked. We we're setting up a little tour, like a little five day tour around that, which is awesome. kind of the maximum that I can do at my age. And you know, I mean, I got uh, I got my daughter's ten, my youngest yeah. is ten, so it's kind of like I can't be away for too long of work and have that. But if yeah. people, you know, all, all my bandmates know we're all about the same kind of age range, and this is like. Oh man, we're gonna do this! I can't wait! I can't you know. wait! And and that's Wowza and Kalamazoo of your twenty bands you're in. And you know, I've <laughs> yeah. lost track. I've lost track again. Thank you so much. I've lost track of all the songs, the uh, Wowza songs I've played in my podcast over the years. But the the oh. one that stands out to me is Crown Shy, which was the uh, intro and outro for the Barbara Cotton season five. And then I oh, think yeah. is it Magdalena that I have that right with um, season. Six? six seven as well yeah so, yes yeah 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 just thank yep. you again i mean i it's just i don't know for me it's it's almost like i can't separate wowza with dakota spotlight anymore <laughs> oh you know i gotta say james i feel very similarly i do i mean it's it's a band and it's a full band you know five of us and stuff but it started yeah. as like a kind of a cross-country recording project i, I would write songs my mm -hmm. friend would help he'd mix and it just sort of turned into this big thing and i have really fond uh memories of like early covid year yeah um uh of listening to your podcast and talking to you and and then just kind of sharing our art with each other you oh, make this man. art i'm i make my art and it was i felt like i found like a little kindred spirit sort of it's like a, a absolutely a bro, so. absolutely so yeah. again we're talking may 13th in bismarck at the laughing sun i'm gonna be there i can't wait to see you guys um are you gonna can Will you play Crown Shy, do you think? 
yeah, we're gonna play first. <laughs> we already, we, we're getting a. I think the guy at Laughing Sun asked us to play two or three sets, which oh, cool. You know, some of our songs are very long, so that won't be a big deal. <laughs> but we were settled like, yeah, let's. We're gonna play Crown Shy first, and we'll oh, play awesome. all of, yeah. And my, I, I believe just a a quick shout out. I believe my mom and dad will be there, which is special for me. So <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> They'll drive. Yeah, they're going to drive up from Wishick, North Dakota to see it. And um, yeah, I'm I'm really, really stoked. I don't get home much anymore, you know, and I miss I miss North Dakota. I miss home. So. Yeah. All right. By the way, do you know your other gigs that week if you want to tell people about it, or do you not know yet? Yeah. So, uh, well, Thursday night, uh, that Thursday, that would be May the 11th. Gosh, 11th. 11th. Yeah. We're going to be in Kalamazoo. May 12th, we're going to be in a town. Gosh, I should have looked up. I'm sorry. It's just outside the Twin Cities. Mm-hmm. We're playing like a, a kind of theater place. Cool. And then Bismarck. On the 14th, we're off. I think we're just going to drive and kind of hang out in Minneapolis and eat Vietnamese food. And then the 15th, <laughs> we'll be in Chicago. And <laughs> Oh, wow. And Chicago. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, well, I'll make sure I post all those dates and uh, uh, gigs on and Facebook as well. But uh, Yeah, thank you so much. That's very sweet of you. Yeah, yeah. I can't wait. In fact, I'm going to leave everyone here at the end of this episode with, uh, I think I'll play Crown Shy, even though it's, uh, uh, I, I associate it to the Barbara Cotton story now, but I'll leave them with that. And oh. dude, I can't wait to meet you on the, in two months from today on, in Bismarck at Laughing Sun. I can't wait. I can't wait to see you and anybody else who uh, I knew back in the day in Bismarck. Please, you know, uh, I'm not saying come out to see the show, but I'd like to just talk to you. Come on and say hi. So that'd be awesome. Yeah, that'd be rad. Yeah. So cool, my friend. Yeah. It was great talking to you again. Um, enjoy you your too. soup. <laughs> ah, thank you. I will. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Later. Cool. Bye, bye, James. That was Ike with Wowza in Kalamazoo. Come out with me to see them live on May 13th at the Laughing Sun Brewery in Bismarck. Once again, if you knew Joel Loveline and can share anything about who he was as a person, please email me at dakotaspotlight at gmail.com. Thank you. Episode 3 will be out on Wednesday. Thanks so much for listening. I'll leave you with a song by Wowza and Kalamazoo. This is Crown Shy. Until I couldn't live